Pisces, welcome. Oh wow, I hope you can see the brown pelicans out there just bobbing. It's kind of low tide. Welcome, Tarot Me Amore. It's the special beach edition of Tarot Me Amore. I'm just going to call every time we have, have, can do it out here, special because it is. <laughs> and I'm grateful. All right, guys, we're doing your singles read here now. And uh, we do that every Saturday, Aquarius and Pisces. We do the couples, heart spread, and the singles. Four pillars read. This is your four pillars read, your singles. Super singles, I hope, okay? Because we want to clear the runway and um, clear the decks. And we're going to ask uh, Spirit Airlines to fly in your soulmate now. No messing around here. That's what we're asking from the cards. Um, we don't want the next problem, the next ex-husband, wife, girlfriend, boyfriend. We want the soulmate. Ding, ding. Winner, winner. Chicken dinner in Pisces is what we're looking for here. Okay, the brass ring. All right, I'm shuffling on the table because I feel like I'm out of toddler tables here. Um, oh, wow. First through the 7th of April, Spirit. I'm looking for a little bit of a time frame. Okay, be open. Look for this person. Join a dating site and use this, I tell you. You can probably find this out nowadays. Texting before you even meet most of this. Try to include some stories. This is the four pillars and of a relationship as well. We're going to look now at their uh, Knight of Wands. This is their intellectual or this is their emotional and the hanged man. Okay. Here. And um, it's a little different reading, so the cards are not exactly. I don't read them quite normally, I guess you'd say. Okay. Because this, uh, this is how they are emotionally, huh? A little hot and cold there. My blows hot and cold. Okay, remember this is your person. Okay, we're assuming that this is your person. Knight. Okay, two of pentacles is interesting in the intellect here. So they're in the seven. Okay, they have a keen mind. Okay, Virgo comes to mind. I also try to use astrology and Virgo screaming at Virgo here. Uh, so intellect. So moon. Could, a lot of people realize how much the moon has to do with our intellect. Sun. Uh, but also Mercury. Look for a Mercury or a Mars um, here, something in Virgo, because, uh, man, they're really good at discerning things. So also, your person, um, they may tell you a story where they don't like liars and how good they are at telling when people are lying, because they would, you know, you they would spot a lie from a mile away. It's like their mind is, like, built for that, okay? Um so let's see we're going to look at now their sexual nature actually in this case the devil is kind of good here because this is your person remember okay this is your person let's go with this so it could be capricorn obviously i like to look at mars and venus here so also express your sexual and your venus love energy so that could be a mars and capricorn guys and um with the two of wands also very nice Maybe they have a fire Venus here. Um, but, wow. Uh, also, with the devil, I think I have a Venus in Scorpio. It could be Venus in Scorpio. I know it's Capricorn, but with that devil energy, when I see it here, um, this is someone that could be a little kinky in bed. But I see with the two of wands here. And uh, two of wands, too, a little wide open. Uh, Sagittarius Mars. Um and maybe you know i like i have a sag mars and uh scorpio venus is possible um but this is someone that's gonna have that closet <laughs> or if not they're gonna really enjoy that uh, side of sexuality and fully fully expressing it with the two of wands here okay um it's not exactly like a choice in this position so five of cups this is in their core values and um lifestyle column in the nine of swords wow so they may have had a tough time i haven't seen this in a while um they may have had a tough time in life with their career and i go with astrology too reminds you a little bit of a gemini midheaven 
because you go through a lot of careers. And so I'm trying to think of a story they might tell. They might say, well, you say, hey, you know, telling your stories, you're getting to meet. Remember, this is your guy, your girl. Uh, what do you do for a living? Oh, you know, I do this, uh, and, you know, I used to do that. And they may list 10 different things they used to do, see? Um, and with the combination of the Four of Cups and the Nine of Swords, that's why I say Gemini Midheaven, they might just kind of get bored um, easily. And they need a lot of different stimulation. So um, I don't think this someone's going to want to just sit around the house. They're going to want to get up and, and get out of this energy. They may not really like the house. I'm going to be like a Cancer, um, like a Sagittarius 4th house, you know. I know someone that's a Sagittarius 4th house, and it's almost like they kind of don't like coming home, you know. Uh, remember, this is your person, so let's keep that in mind. So if there's a little bit of that vibe, uh, it's not like about you. It's about some sense with them that they they really uh, they like to be go out and get out of this energy. Um, I don't know, they may have had a, dealt a lot with financial difficulties. You might get that story too, uh, in their life, okay? So, and I, I don't see them as being someone who's going to have a lot of money, guys. Or this is your person, so universe, you know, decides. So it's not like a lot of ticket, and it's uh, going to be somebody's heart that's the right one for you. And the magic of that, then yours is going to be the right one for them. So, with their emotions, um, I said hot and cold, and that's totally a, a part of it. Um, I'm trying to think with their intellect. They're very grounded, too. This may come across in the sexuality, which is going to be good. They're going to be very grounded. They're not going to be anything erratic. It's going to feel good. It's going to feel grounding, like when they hug you gonna feel good it's gonna be like ah you can you can let go into that um they may have learned to back and take it down a notch like they may have learned to they may have learned how to ha hold their temper i mean honestly the knight of wands could be someone that's kind of hot has say blow hot and cold someone who can blow up quick now this uh would be like a fire Mars, Aries Mars, or something here. Um, uh, but uh, in the, the here it could be the moon, uh, fire moon. So they may have learned over life that they need to stop and think a minute. Okay, uh, uh, about their emotions, really. Um, like they they can't kind of get a grip on it. Like maybe they get an emotion. It's kind of a. Uh, is a fire sign moon kind of thing and you know they want to like do something about it like they don't want to feel it's like air signs want to think about their emotions fire signs want to do something about their emotions and with the hanging man coming in here um this pisces energy it's like you know take the fire and dip it in the water and shh, kind of take it down you know cool it down um so there's a kind of balance maybe to them emotionally but it would have been something they achieved over time. So they could tell a story about that. About, well, they might say, look for them to say, and you can kind of prod them a little bit, guys. Hey, um, when I was younger, I was a wild man, you know, and they're going to not be a wild man now. Or I was a wild woman and I was crazy and da da da, and they're not a wild woman now. Um, I definitely see that kind of story coming. Um, and um, with the two of pentacles, the last thing I'll say, and the seven of pentacles, a, a kind of a self-made woman, self-made man uh, story of some kind, they're going to tell you. Um, I'm a, I was a single mother, and I had to go on welfare a while, and I finished my law degree, and da-da-da. Um, you know, uh, I was uh, a guy, and I didn't have anybody to help me, and I had to put myself through school. Pick themselves up by the bootlaces, kind of thing, and I think like with your person, they use their mind well. Okay, that's their real strength is just a good solid mind. They don't 
they can they can concentrate you know anything that needs to be if you need something figured out like you'll tell them if you're like me you're like oh my god i can't figure out this app they'll be like let me see it and they'll calmly look figure it out and hand it back to you this is your person Pisces. so let me know what you think and um first to the seventh of april guys thank you for joining us on the beach We'll see you again for next week on Saturdays, of course.